of a good afternoon from a rainy TTC. Yeah, we're having kind of a rainy day today. Um, it's cooler than the 60s. It's cold. And um, we're actually walking over right now to the Polynesian. We're gonna have some lunch. Yeah. And then we're gonna walk over then, or not walk over, I guess, take the monorail over uh, to Magic Kingdom for the afternoon mm -hmm. and walk around a little bit. It seems like it's a bit busier than we thought it would be. Yeah. Because um, we figured the, the rain would kind of drive everybody off. Um, it's but, also Super Bowl weekend. Yeah, so maybe that and has something to do with Miami it. Miami this year. Yeah. Um, so not entirely sure. But in any case, and we're gonna try to enjoy the rainy weather, maybe do some pin trading because we've got plenty of pins to trade, and see where the day takes us. Little known fact, if you park at the TTC and want to get over to the Polynesian a little bit quicker, if you come over to the hero side, over in the woody parking lot where I believe most cast members park, you can actually take what I'm pretty sure is just kind of like a cast member pedestrian bridge that a lot of them do to walk over to the poly. So, if you come over on this side, kind of hug the wall closest to the actual TTC. You'll eventually get to a little bridge and you can take that right over to the Polynesian and have a nice little leisurely stroll. And since it's kind of a natural area, you might see some animals. Like Kelly. In her natural habitat. <laughs> it's a little cold and it has wet feet. My feet are wet. Yeah. So there's nothing worse than having a wet Oh. Yeah, that's true, 100%. With puddles. I shouldn't have worn my rain boots. Yeah, I didn't think it'd be as puddly. Yeah. Here we are at Captain Cook's. I got the turkey club melt sandwich. Looks really good. It's got turkey on it, some tomatoes, some Havarti cheese, I think bacon and stuff on it, and some fries. And Kelly got the Thai coconut meatballs served over rice. Yeah, hey, it looks really good. I'm excited. I haven't had Captain Cook's in a really long time. Yeah, it's been a long while. Um, just a nice option if you don't want to eat Magic Kingdom to walk over here, have lunch before you go in the parks. Yeah. We just finished lunch. So we're gonna have the fastest <laughs> lunch review ever because as we stepped outside, it's raining. It started raining more. Um, uh, and the inside was really busy, so it's a Saturday, busy. so it's like check-in, check-out day. Um, lunch was really good. Highly recommend Delicious. the Thai coconut curry meatballs. And I highly recommend the oh, turkey melt. It's, it's fantastic. It's been kind of hard finding, as we're dining and exercising now, you may know, finding those lighter options. Yeah. I recommend checking out the resorts more than the parks themselves. 100%. Because you can find things like that that are lighter but still filling. You yeah. Know? So it's really, very good. Yeah. So we're going to head back inside and check out some shops. Into the boutique tiki. See what they got. Mm. Hawaiian host macadamia is dry roasted with sea salt. Um. Let's oh, see. that's a new founders collection. Huh. Oh, here's like a bag of them. No, those are no, different. That's different? Oh. Yeah, Mar Maui's Caramax, Aloha Max. Interesting. Yeah, I wonder where uh, where they are. Huh. Oh, well. guess we can't really have the chocolates anyways. I know. There's one by one. Um, post called Toffee Max, and it's yeah. toffee macadamia nuts covered in milk chocolate. Unbelievably good. They're so good. Pretty much every time we come to Polynesia, we have to get not a box of them. Now. Yeah, I guess not anymore, it's but so oh, so good. It's a nice little hooded sweatshirt. Yeah. They were at has Polynesian on it. The little guy, the uh, no worries guy, and it is fifty four ninety nine. Is there anything on the back? Nope. Blank back. So That's really nice. nice. And it almost like the, the texture almost looks sort of like jean, that like look to it. Obviously, it's it's very soft cotton, but uh, yeah, it's really nice. Dang, tempting. All right, Kelly, gonna get this for the cruise. I kind of want it. It's yeah. My underground artist Anne Chen. I love her work, and I also love tiki drinks. That's true. <laughs> How much is that? Thirty-four ninety-nine. Correct. Thirty-four yeah. ninety-nine. Not too too terrible. So cute though. It is pretty I cute. They have a lot of the other 
styles of that same print here. Oh, They've cool. got the pillow, I never saw that. postcard, and an actual print, which is $40. This is so cool. Oh, I didn't even notice the back of it had some tiki's yeah. on it. That's fun. So much fun. We're in Moana Mercantile. And you can buy a minivan. It's Five really funny. Nine. Cheaper than the trip of a minivan. It's true. I do highly recommend a minivan experience though. It is so nice. At least once. At least once, yeah. Special occasion. the walkway that they're building there on the left that will at some point connect the Grand Floridian with Magic Kingdom. So once this whole thing is constructed, you'll actually be able to walk from what used to be the sidewalk to nowhere all the way over to the Grand Floridian. We made it in and it has stopped raining. Hooray! So I don't have to have my umbrella anymore. Let's go in, see what's going on. Let's see what the Happa Haps are today in a rainy Magic Kingdom. I kind of like it when it's raining. Me too. It's fun. Usually less busy, probably not this weekend. Yeah. But... Oh wow, City Hall is under an enormous amount of scrim. So I don't know if they're repainting it or doing some remodeling or something, but that is all large. I've never seen it under that much like scaffolding and, and scrim before, it's crazy. Well, we walked in and they remodeled all of Magic Kingdom Emporium. Uh, the pins are no longer over there like they used to be. They appear to be clear across the way, probably to improve congestion. Um, holy moly. Let's go see what they got. Because uh, the Series 2 of Tiny Kingdom came out just the other day. So we are going to see if they have any, as well as to look for any uh, cranberry pin packs. So they don't have any in the Kingdom of Cute. They do have this Winnie the Pooh sign. They have a Seven Dwarfs Mine Train and an Under the Sea with Ariel uh, kind of ride uh, sign pins. Somehow still doing the Move It, Shake and Mask a Dance It Parade, even though it has begun to sprinkle again. Kind of misting. Uh, so I'm not gonna break out my umbrella quite yet, but it might soon if it gets harder. We're heading out head over to Space Mountain to see We'll see you real soon. It's good, 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 a good time. Oh yeah, we're gonna dance on our It's good, good, good. Copyright. There's that new Tomorrowland sign. Are you in the camp of old Tomorrowland sign? Or are you team new Tomorrowland sign? I am firmly in the new. I like the cleaner look to it and I hope they kind of do that with the rest of it. I like me some retro futurism, but sometimes you gotta give it a little spin a I like it too, it's just very small. It is a little small, it's a bit sad. Yeah. Um, but hopefully they'll kind of match that with the rest of, of uh, Tomorrowland once they eventually do the very long rumored and planned kind of refurb and refresh of the whole area. Because we still got Stitch they gotta deal with. I could see them updating the left floor in some capacity, same with uh, Astro Orbiter um, and probably coming in 2021 with some Tron, uh, but we'll see I guess. We are now in the Tomorrowland Power Company. Fun fact, this is called the Tomorrowland Power Company. They do still have some of those very unorthodox, oh, cool. but cool nonetheless, coffee cups. They'd be very hard to drink from. I love it. But it's amazing, it looks like Space Mountain for it's the anniversary, 45th. Jar. This one makes more sense. Yeah, Humongo cookie jar that, ooh that's like... Okay, that's like in there, so I'm not gonna go try to pull out that off. Okay, well, that works. You can only fit four large cookies inside. <laughs> it's really cool, though. I it is that. amazingly like, cool. Like, the just to have it out would be really, really cool. And I love this Tomorrowland Peep Mover shirt. Pretty cool. Uh, but let's see if they have some of the anniversary merch. For those adventurous among us, I conquered the People Mover. Ah. <laughs> It's threw on the ground. I think it conquered you. It's conquered me. <laughs> Definitely is continued sprinkling. According to the radar, it's supposed to stop at this point. Uh, still coming down. 
If I didn't have this camera, it'd be pretty nice. A continual mist. It's not yeah. even raining or sprinkling. It's literally just like a fine mist. Yeah. So we're gonna head over now, probably to see if Big Top is open because we did hear the other day that it was closed again for some unknown reason. And uh, go from there. Probably after that, head over to to <laughs> Frontier Land, and then Kelly's gonna get lost in her own jacket. <laughs> So we did come into Frontier Trading Post to get the new Tiny Kingdom set. This is Series 2. They have tons. Really cute options. You do get two in each pack. So we're going to open up and see what we got. I lied. We actually get three, not two. So it's a pretty good deal. It was 17 and change after our um, annual pass holders count. Oh, we got the rose. Enchanted rose. Super cute. We got the Dapper Dan hat. Super cute. And number three. Oh, I got the little gold oh, tram. Oh, got the tram. That's so cute. I love it. I love it. Awesome. Okay, so we got another pack. Um, because we're weak. But we also need more trip pins to trade because this is a hobby that we're into now guys so that's just kind of what happens so the first one that we got on the second one is oh the little clam mobile oh the clam from voyage of the little mermaid super cute and the second one is oh casey jr <gasps> casey jr is a pen and it's really cute and i love it too and the third one is I can get it open, my goodness. Dun, da, da, da. Oh my goodness, it's like stuck in there. <gasps> popcorn! Oh, popcorn. I love it, that's super cute. Great. So it's like kind of slowing down, it's but as you we were walking before, it was like crazy misting. So even with the umbrella, like everything was getting wet. Um, so Big Top Souvenirs was closed yeah. as we walked over there. No one really knows why. Crazy. No fire or anything again, so that was weird. Yeah. Um, where else did we stop? We, oh yeah, we went to Memento Mori. Oh yeah. And Is anything new in there? Nothing new in there, nothing going on. And then just came over to Frenchie. And so, I guess we'll walk now over to maybe Adventureland yeah. and poke through and see what's going on over that side. Hopefully it's slowing down so I can keep filming as we walk, but yeah. if it gets too crazy, I just have to put the camera in my yeah. pocket. So. It is that time of year for the annual refurbishment of Splash Mountain. As you can see, lots of scrim, ton, ton of facade work going on outside. You can even hear them working. So they put up kind of the larger scrims so you can't see down into the track anymore. Interesting to see if they're just sprucing it up or if they make any changes. Looking at a 40 minute wait for Pirates. Definitely busier than it seems today, especially with all this rain. But I suppose with it being Saturday, it's going to be a little yeah. busier than expected. It's looking nice though, with the weather. It is, yeah. Like cool. And I think the mist has finally like stopped. Yeah, it's nice. nice. Well, I think it'll wrap up our Sort of quick day at Magic Kingdom. Did you have fun? Yeah, it did. Yeah. Uh, even though it was kind of rainy for a little part of the yeah, like a really first mist, part of it. Continual mist, which was strange. Yeah. But medium crowd levels. Didn't ride anything, but saw some fun merch. Um, got some nice Tiny Kingdom in. pins. Yeah, got some pins. Which I didn't think we'd even find because everybody was saying like, they oh, they sold out super so fast. fast. And I think they came out yesterday or the day before. So. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it was nice. We haven't been to Magic Kingdom in a, lot, a couple weeks since we've been prioritizing Epcot and the festivals, but yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was really nice. It was a yeah, fun it was day. Nice. So if you liked our video, make sure to give us a thumbs up uh, in the comments below. If you enjoy going to Disney in the rain, let us know. Yeah. If you want to see more of our adventures, make sure to subscribe, click the bell icon to get notified every time we go live for new videos. And as always, we will see you next time for more Young at the Parks. Bye,